See why Bola Metinibu travel to Iro. B2B takes action. Hello Nigerians, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is unacceptable for Bola Metinibu to be absent in the court sitting yesterday. And irrespective of the fact that the judiciary is a respected arm of the government, Bola Metinibu disrespected them and sent a representative even after they have warned him or you know cautioned him to appear in the court over the petitions B2B filed against his presidency. You know, INEC hurriedly gave Bola Metinibu that mandate without checking some you know, grievances and irregularities that occurred in that election. And this has caused a lot of distractions of recent. P2B appeared in the courts while he seated in the court with his legal team, well representing to defend the mandate and show and prove that he outrightly won that election. But recently, so many rumors have been going through that Bola Metinimbu, he actually traveled to Europe. It was barely a month he came back, but he has traveled again. And so many rumors have been going through. Everybody is so inquisitive. Everybody wants to know the reason why Bola Metinibu traveled just a few days from inauguration. Inauguration will be taken up on the 29th of May. So he, he's, he's supposed to be take, take, take over from President Mwadu Buhari to continue the affairs of the government. But just a few months when he came back from you know, UK, he has traveled again to Europe. And Nigerians have been reacting. Is this the way he's going to rule? Is this the way everything is going to be occurring when he sits as the president of the country? But recently, his aide has just come to clear the fact and you know, to state it that Bola Metinimbu left Nigeria for Europe on a working visit two weeks after returning to the country from a trip in Saudi Arabia. In a statement signed by his aide, Tunde Rehman, he said Tunde, Tunde, Bola Metinimbu used this, used this opportunity you know, to fine-tune the transition plans and programs and his policy options with some of his key aides without necessary pressures and distractions. He also equally said that during the visit, that Bola Metinimbu will engage with investors and other key allies with the goal of marketing investment opportunities in the country and his administration readiness to make sure he puts Nigeria and, you know, makes Nigeria to achieve his goal. That he's going to meet investors. Which investors is Bola Metinimbu going to meet? Why is it that the APC are not always transparent in all their dealings? Is it not very simple that if Bola Metinimbu is not healthy or he's not strong, it is very clear that they should come to the internet space and detail it that probably he will, he will go from there to see his doctor to be strengthened over the inauguration that will be coming up on 29th of May. This is exactly what Nigerians are expecting, that the APC and AIDS of Bola Metinibu should be transparent in all their dealings. At this point in time, P2B, the court has adjoined the case of P2B and Bola Metinibu till the 17th of May. P2B needs to take action because he needs to take action to make sure that Bola Metinibu appears in the court. Because if Bola Metinibu fails to appear in the court, the court section will be, also, or will be adjoined and probably the Bola Metinibu is sworn in. And if Bola Metinibu is sworn in as the president, this may, you know, distract P2B from making sure he reclaims his mandate. You have not seen the reasons why P2, Bola Metinibu traveled and all the rumors that have been roving around and the day the court has postponed there and has joined the case. Get to the comment section, react over this. What is your tick? What is your feel over this? What is your pain over Bola Metinibu's absence in the court? Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, follow this channel so that you get notified of every update on Bola Metinibu and P2B's case.